Good morning, everybody. My name's Waylon, but you knew that already. It's a storming day, which means I won't... I don't really... Everyone's gonna be inside, so I guess I can just... You know what? Wellwick, am I going to the mines today? Yes, I am. Okay, I'll have a little extra luck. Uh, weather report tomorrow. It's gonna be sunny. Okay. Ah, summer rains. Who can predict them? Am I right, everyone? Anyway, uh, hello everyone. My name is Waylon, but you knew that already. Welcome back to Stardew Valley. Uh, in the last episode, we Welcome had Cracker Jack Luck, way. and instead We're of taking advantage of it and going straight to the mines or going now. fishing, I just kind of dicked around and then tried to go to the mines too late, uh, and then I died, and then Mr. Linus had to save me, and then I tried to go back, and then I had to fight a, a, a giant bat swarm. It was a real, it was an, an inconvenience for every party involved, if I'm being honest with you. But anyway, hey look, corn. Did you know that corn grows in both the summer and the fall? I gotta get out there, man. I gotta go. I gotta plant some corn, man! Well, now I'm talking about corn. Demetrius? Well, what's up, buddy? How you doing, man? Hi, Waylon. I have some good news for you. A few days ago, I made a breakthrough in my research on the local environment. That's great, buddy. Yeah, yeah, spare me the technical details and get to the point, man. You know that empty cave over there, a little ways to the west? Well, I have a way to turn it into something useful for the both of us. What do you mean by that? I'd like to set up the cave to attract some local species. That way I can observe them in a more controlled environment. And you can harvest whatever products they produce. I can either set up the cave to attract mushrooms or fruit bats. The bats will sometimes leave fruit for you to collect. Okay, now the mushrooms I'm pretty sure are more, from a pure profit standpoint, I think it's the mushrooms. The bats can bring in fruit that are out of season though. But I always go for bats, so I think this time I'll go for mushrooms. All right, I'll go set it up for Re right now. It shouldn't take any time at all. Thanks for letting me do this. No problem, Demetrius. Sorry you had to make the trek over here in the rain. Uh, harvest you, plant you, plant you. If I plant you, I'd be put you in the furnace. I'm pretty sure I saw that our uh, stuff, our hay and such, were ready. And I can barely contain my excitement, which is why I'm choking over my words for some reason. Oh yeah, sometimes I forgot when it rains, it just kind of makes those horrible, scary noises. Let's see here. Yes! Yes! Hell yeah! Look at all that, baby! That's awesome! Anything else for this grand, meticulously planted harvest? Hell yeah! We got a poppy. We got, uh, I don't even remember what this is. A second poppy. Why did it... Oh, no, wait. Yeah, a second poppy. Why is it white? That's cool. Interesting. Uh, Scraggles, how are you today? That was creepy. Scraggles, oh, you're looking very happy today. That's very good. Now that I have properly harvested wheat, I can put that in the community bundle. Where do I have the wheat at? Uh, not there. Uh, not here. In here. Yes, one wheat. Let's see. Summer crops. Uh, I don't have anything for you yet. Quality crops. I have nothing for you yet. Artition. No. 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 Where do I need weed at? Ah, the fodder bundle, of course. I just need three apples and I'll be done with that. I have the wheat, I have the hay. At least I'm pretty sure I do anyway. I mean, I can always just cut this to get more hay. Uh, it's not going to my stockpile. It must be going straight to the silo. Hey, don't you me, okay? Fight me yourself, ghost. You know how many ghosts I've killed? Okay, I'm sorry. I learned my lesson. You won't hear anything from me anymore. <laughs> uh, I'm chilling, man. I'm good. I'm fine. Can I get some of this hay to actually go into my inventory? I would really, really appreciate that. Instead, I'm just kind of mucking about. 
again, as usual. Come on, I have to be overflowing with, with, with the stuff at some point. Jesus! I said I was sorry! As long as you don't strike any of my crops, I think we'll just be... We'll get along like a couple schoolgirls. Everything will be all hunky-dory. Okay, I'm full. So I can't... I wonder if I can take any more out. And by that, I mean take some out of the silo. Uh, no, it doesn't seem like it. Uh, can I take some out from here? Hi, Scraggles. Can I borrow some food? No, it would appear not. Hmm. Well, I don't want to risk putting my hay in there like I did yesterday. Ugh. Whatever. Uh, okay, well, since I don't have to worry about this, I'll just go uh, straight to the community center and then to the mines. Hey, Vincent, this is for you. That's terrific. Thank you so much. I want to be just like my big bro when I grow up. Okay, bye. There's a little less pollen in the summer. My nose is really happy. Did you wipe your boots off before coming in? Sorry, I, I just cleaned the floor. <laughs> but you're always welcome in here. <laughs> you're no problem, buddy. You haven't given any gifts. Hated gifts. I have not given Sam a single gift. God damn. Quick update, stopped by the river, caught this shad here. See, now I'm a little bit determined. I'm gonna go and I'm gonna fucking catch it. I fucking catfish. Yes, asshole! Oh, pike. Okay, I got the feeling this is the catfish. Look, you fucking dick! I'm, I'm done, fuck it. No, I'm not done, I'm, I'm gonna do this one more time. And then, I went over here, deposited my poppy, and deposited my Wheat. Anyway. Oh, hello. I did not expect this, I'll tell you that right now. Playing the flute in the middle of a thunderstorm? You play that thing well, Abby. I remember playing the recorder back in third grade band class. Uh, I was just doing some work, but I was enjoying the weather. But, you know, I could ask you the same question. Yeah, I guess you would be the one to appreciate this somber ambience. I like the rain. It never rains here in town, so I always appreciate it more when it does happen. I came here to spend some time alone. Oh, okay, I'll leave then. But I don't mind your company. Oh, well, okay then. Uh, come stand under the... Yeah, Alright, sure. You know, I do have a hat specifically for this situation so that I don't get too soaked. It's impossible to describe this feeling, watching the curtains of rain whisper above a silent lake. Do you write poetry? You seem like you do. But look what I got! Mm-hmm. Found this in my grandpa's attic. I didn't know he had an attic, but I found it. I sure am full of surprises. Now check this out. You know how much Skyward Sword I played on Wii? I'm gonna be so good at this. Check me out. Now that was awesome. 
Personally, I didn't know I could play instruments, but hey, I'm full of surprises, just like Abby said. I was eyeballing this grape the second the cutscene started. Speaking of Abby, where did she go? Did she, like, warp away? Whoa! Okay, I guess that solves that question. Uh, you know what? Before I go to the mines, I'm gonna try to fish one last time. Come on! I need a catfish! I gotta complete that damn river fish bundle! It's driving me insane. I need a catfish! Give it to me now! 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 Ooh. No, this fish doesn't seem like a complete psychopath. It's probably not a catfish. A bullhead. Doesn't even go in a bundle. I also caught three pikes, by the way. Whatever. Back to the mines, I suppose. A lonely man such as myself. You could say I belong in the mines, that I'm one with them. Barely leaves any space for me, but, you know, whatever. Ooh, that goes pretty good. You know, maybe, I, maybe I've been sleeping on daggers. Maybe they're a lot better than I initially thought they were. Who knows? I just hope I'm going to be able to get out of here without any interference from a rather annoying entities such as this damn ghost. Who knows? Maybe I'll even get some nice treasure. I said, maybe I'll get some nice treasure. There we go. Didn't get any nice treasure, but uh, I did get to swat that ghost away. What's going on up here? Whole secret little room. You know, it's. I feel like a staircase would be up here. Like if it was, you know. Whoa! Gold! I can complete the bundle with this. Ooh, and some quartz too. Ooh, and that frozen tear. Everything's finally going my way. It seems that way, anyway. This is great. You know, I feel like I'm owed a nice lucky day. I've had... Okay, see, that's what I get for actually speaking. Hey, a topaz. Give me a topaz and some iron. Inventory full? Your mom's inventory is full! Get away from me! Get away! Back, demons! Get away from me! Go! Go! Get out! Ugh. I just... Let me eat my raw green algae! Dead. Ooh, some copper? I could go for some copper. I'm in desperate need of copper sometimes. Get, get, go! Get away from me! Damn! That was rather frustrating, wouldn't you say? my silver star grape. I shouldn't have cluttered up my inventory, but I didn't have enough time to go back to the house, you see. Now I wonder if I'll even make it past this floor, considering it's already 10 o'clock at night. Well, it's going to be in a few seconds anyway. Yeah, see, there it goes. Hey, maybe I'll get some nice treasure along the way. Maybe I won't. I'd like to make it to floor 65. More bats. If there's anything... Are you serious? Elliot wanted a jade, and there's a jade right here. I turned down the quest, too. My inventory's full, because why the hell wouldn't it be? I will sacrifice one sweet pea for you. And did you know that Gunther can tell me more about it if I donate it to the frickin' museum? I'm not mad. Why would I be mad? That I found a cool thing and I have to donate it? Yeah, for the greater good, right? For science? You know, what is, what, if, what is the town of Pelican Town? Uh, what have they ever done for me? Hmm? Have they ever donated any great goods for me? Hmm? Clearly not. Forced to eat my nice grape. All in the pursuit of a magical appearing staircase! There we go. 
Don't come over here with that bullshit. I mean, kind of a pickle. More gold, more sun spheres, sunstones, whatever the hell they're called. These things, solar essences. See, you know what I'm talking about, so I don't even have to explain myself. If that staircase could appear like any second, that'd be, I, that'd be pretty great. I'd really appreciate it. No, still I get to deal with these assholes. Oh, it's midnight. Look at that. Please, for the love of God! Okay, I'm gonna hurry up, find the staircase. It's gonna be under here. It's gonna be under here. I brought this damn slingshot and I didn't even freaking use it. Look, you're starting to feel exhausted. Don't come at me with that bullshit. Please, for the love of God. I guess I can eat this raw fish. Come on, it's gonna be, it's gonna be right under here. I know it is. Okay, it's gonna be right under here. I know it is. Oh, come on, one in the morning already. Fine, all right, you win, I'm leaving. Some luck, am I right? Oh shit, it's 110. I don't know if, I actually don't know if I'll make it. This is really bad. I think this is the first time I won't make it home. I toiled in God's domain and I'm going to pay the price for it! I think maybe with some luck I'll make it home right at 150, but I'm starting to sincerely doubt that. I know I won't have time to deposit any of this shit in my house. In the chest, I mean. Go, 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 go. Come on, please. It's right there. I'm right here. I'm right here, man. Yes! Oh my god, I barely made it! But I'm home! Spaghetti, come sleep on the floor with me, please. Oh. That's what I call a close shave. Good night, everybody. Ugh.